Welcome back, guys. So, there's this little movie coming out next week. I'm not sure if you've heard about it. It's called Star Wars The Force Awakens. As a huge nerd and a lifelong Star Wars fan, it's safe to say that I am very excited. And it turns out I'm not the only one that's excited because Ample Hills has decided to create two flavors inspired by the greatest film franchise in movie history. If you're watching this review right now, I'm going to assume you like ice cream and Star Wars, just like me. So it should come as no surprise that I ordered both these flavors as soon as they became available. Tonight, we're gonna to be having the light side and the dark side from Ample Hills. The light side is marshmallow ice cream with crispy clusters and just a smattering of cocoa crispy clusters to represent the little bit of dark side and the light side of the force. The dark side is dark chocolate ice cream with espresso fudge brownies, chocolate crispies, and white chocolate pearls to represent that little bit of good in the dark side. Alright guys, I know you're as excited as I am, so let's just get to it. Let's find out if these flavors are more Empire Strikes Back or Phantom Menace. Which one to start with? Well, I don't know about you guys, but I've always gravitated more towards the dark side myself. I mean, the Black Cloaks, Darth Maul, Darth Vader. The Sith are just cooler than the Jedis. So I'm going to go with the dark side first. It should come as no surprise. Sample Hills is one of the greatest ice cream companies in America. This dark chocolate ice cream is fantastic. The espresso brownies are chewy, moist, pretty big. This is what we're working with. You can kind of see the first pearl right there. This is not the strongest dark chocolate base I've ever had, but it's still damn good. It's really hard to see the mix-ins, but I mean, it's Dark as hell, dark chocolate. So you got a chewy mix in, you got a crunchy mix in, a lot of good textures going on here too. So it's almost like a, um, almost like, it's like chocolate pudding. It's fantastic though. It's almost a shame I have to split these pints and I could eat this whole thing. Time for some light side. As there should be, there's a stark contrast between the two bases here. You got dark chocolate on the dark side. This one is much sweeter with the marshmallow base. It's way sweeter. That's the light side. It's a little bit easier to see the mix-ins in the light side because it's white. So, even though the base is really sweet, it is very tasty. It reminds me a lot of Snap Mallow Pop from Ample Hills if you've had that. It's very similar. I love that flavor, so I love this flavor. Both these flavors are awesome, but which one that I prefer? That is the question. If you watch my channel regularly, you know I love dark chocolate, so you know which one I'm going with here. The dark side was clearly my favorite, and I think it will be your favorite too. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. If you're a Star Wars fan like me, and you love great ice cream, you know you have to buy these. Do or do not. There is no try. Go to AmpleHills.com, order them before it's too late, and they're gone forever. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time, and may the Force be with you. Merry Christmas, happy holidays.